Hey, today I'm going to be teaching you how to convert any ROM into a .cia file to be played on your 3DS. So this works on NES, SNES, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance, and I believe Famicom games. So the first thing you want to do is turn off your DS and take out the SD card. Okay, so when you put your SD card into the computer, just open up Chrome, click the first link, or yeah, click the first link in the description, and it's going to pull up new Super Ultimate Injector, and it's going to show a list of ROMs that you're able to convert, so you're just going to press download beta, it's going to open up a Dropbox, and you want to go to the top right, click download, and then just press direct download and it should download it'll take a couple it'll take a, a minute to download i'll be right back when it finishes downloading okay so when it finishes downloading just open it up press show in folder right click on it and you have to click extract all you're going to need seven zip for this to extract all the reason you have to do this is because the .exe file will not open if it's not extracted because it needs files in here and they're all zipped if you don't extract it. So then you just open up the application file or the .exe that isn't a config and it takes a little bit to open so I'll be right back when it finishes opening. Okay so once it's finished opening up it's going to show a list of ROMs that you're able to convert to CIA files. In the top left it's going to say Archivo and you have to scroll over Nuevo and choose whichever ROM that you want to convert to a CIA. So for this, I'm just going to be choosing Game Boy Advance, just to show you the, the saving capabilities later. And then you right click on this, and then you just press this, and it's going to open up your files and you just choose which ROM you want to convert. So I'm going to be doing Pokemon Emerald. And this is the cool part, because you get to customize everything about this. So if it recognizes the game, it'll like give you options. So right here, you can use the box art for like the cover. And then this thing, when you scroll over it, it'll be this. That's only if it recognizes it. But you can also do, um, you can also add custom images and change the titles. So it's really cool. You can also use the scroll bar to zoom in and out stuff like that so once you're finished like customizing it right click up here again and then just press export to RCIA press save um you press well that's just because I already did this but you just um when it's done it should say CIA exported so it'll take a couple seconds and boom just like that CIA exported then you just um Um, then you just press, when you exit out, you press no, because you already have the thing saved. And boom, just like that. Then, you need to go grab this, copy it, go to your SD card, and put it in the CIA's folder. So once it's in the CIA's folder in your SD card, take your SD card out and plug it back into your DS. Okay, so once you're back on your 3DS after putting the SD card back into it, just open up your FBI, go into SD, then CIAs, scroll over to your .cia file that you just got, and install it. I already have mine installed, so I'm just going to press start. And the great thing about this new Super Injector is that, is that it has a built-in <clears throat> saving system. So unlike the ultimate injector that didn't save, this one does save and it saves for all ROMs, not just the Game Boy Advance ones. So as you can see, it's opening it perfectly fine, just like that, full screen and everything. And the noise is great too. I'm just going to press new game and I'll be right back when I start a save just so I can show you that it actually does save. Okay, so now that I've created a save file. I'm just going to save the game just to show you that I um that it actually works. So boom, Dalkai saved the game. Now we're going to go to the home and open it up again and see what happens. Everything about this girl, like your 
favorite color. Maybe her favorite food. Yeah. Okay, now we're gonna reopen it. And as you can see, it saved all my progress. No save states, nothing. Just like it's an actual cartridge, actually on your game, it's perfect. So, <clears throat> I hope you've been. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope I've been able to help you. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time.